Yo, what's going on, people? It's your boy Chris Mac Random, your favorite YouTube commentator. Yep, it's time to do some more commentary. Yep, y'all know what I'm gonna talk about this time. It's time to talk about what the Houston Texans have did today. They fired head coach Gary Kubiak. I ain't find out till about eight o'clock on Friday. Which is tonight, and I want to talk to y'all a little bit about it. You know, the Houston Texans dropped 11 straight since starting 2-0 in the 2013 season. The Houston Texans have won the, AF the AFC South in 2011 and 2012. They won two playoff games, beating the Cincinnati Bengals both years. Knocking them out of the playoffs, but they lost in the second round. 2011 was the first time that the Houston Texans went to the playoffs. And they did good that season. But 2013, it's been, it's been tough. You know, they have the number one defense in the NFL. According to NFL Network. Chris Rose and Deion Sanders and them. And you got J.J. Watt, a.k.a. J.J. Swat. And on the offense, it's a lot of trouble at the quarterback position. But yeah, Matt Schaub, he has thrown pick six in not one game, not two games, not three, not four. But like, five straight games and he got hurt and TJ Yates came in and he threw a pick six in that game and like something going on the Case Keenum has started Case Keenum started a few games he, he has played pretty well but Houston had, still was unable to win and it's been really tough for them this season. But really, 11 straight. And you got DeAndre Hopkins, the the rookie wide receiver out of Clemson. He's a good number two receiver. And he's wearing my number, number 10. And it's crazy, though. But... I'm going to leave this to the Houston fan. If you're in the Houston, Texas area, or you're a Texas fan anywhere else, I want you to leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you think about Gary Kupiak's fiery. Oh, and by the way, Wade Phillips is going to take over as the interim head coach for the rest of the season. Maybe, you don't know. You may get Johnny Manziel. Yeah. Don't be surprised if they don't draft the quarterback. Because I think Javion Clowney out of South Carolina is going to be the first quarterback taken in this year's draft. But, yeah. They didn't run her up for the first overall pick. Because everybody else has won three or more games except Houston. The Falcons won their third game this week by beating Buffalo. But yeah, that's all I have to really say. But I hope Houston turn it around next year. They're not in a rebuilding process. They're not going to rebuild because they already got the pieces. I think if they just get a quarterback, a really good quarterback, that can get the Johnson, Johnson and Hopkins. Hey, they, they might be Super Bowl bound. But yeah. I know y'all enjoying this beat. Yeah, Dominique Major. Shout out to you for this beat. But yeah. I'm about to end this commentary. I want y'all to leave comments in the comment section. And let me know what you think. Anybody in Houston, Texas, or surrounding areas, let me know what you think about this firing.
Yep. I am signing out. You already know. It's your boy Chris Mac Random. I am your favorite YouTube commentator. <laughs>